Chamber Channel. Give me lucky charms. Welcome back to the Empty Chamber 556 channel. We got another real time review. Happy St. Patrick's Day, everyone. <laughs> What's going on? We got the Labatt Blue Citra. High, high, high class, high quality, happy session lager. It's a green can, right? Yeah, green can. All St. Patty's. 4.7% alcohol, if you would focus, please. Focus. Yeah, focus, focus, focus. Whatever. People focus. Uh, 30 IBUs, yeah. These were like, what, a dollar thirty per can? Yeah, you know. I, I like Labatt's as a lager, yes, we look like idiots. But, uh, I mean, if they put citra hops in it, add your can, huh? Um, Calm down. He doesn't know what's happening right now. Ah. Oh wow, I smell the sister hops. That's weird. Does it smell good? Yeah. <sighs> Big boy can. Dog, stop. Jesus. He doesn't know who we are. Oh my god, stop. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my god. Eight month old Great Dane. Big dog problems. Smell it. If you can smell a gay Irish porn star. <laughs> I'm not going to show you where it hit me gold. Mm. Oh, wow. Yeah, I do smell it. Oh. We are here to drink your beer. I got... I got fire crotch pubes in my, <laughs> in my mouth. Oh, God. They're always after me lucky time. <laughs> 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 See my hat blinking. Uh, my lady. Epileptic seizure warning. <laughs> that was in my ear. Hi. How are you doing, bud? Yep, it's still us. We're just idiots. <laughs> Got some foam on it, though. Jeez, yeah. Look at that. It smells quite good, actually. Quite good. Surprisingly. Oh my god! This dog just wants to be a part of everything. Okay, ready? Cheers. Puke on me, what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you okay? Do you want a beer? Yeah, I mean, it's like, hi, how are you? It's like, um, citrusy at first. Happy session lager. I didn't see that. Yeah. It's like citrusy at first and it turns Ugh. into a lager. Oh, oh, tickle my ears. It's hard to drink beer with these stupid ass muscles. Yeah. In my face. Yeah, it's a little bit citrusy at first, and then it turns into a straight like Labatt's right afterwards. Yeah, it's not bad. No. I mean, if you like Labatt's and, and you like IPAs, and this would be like a step up for you if you want to get into an IPA. What? Because it's got... Do you like Labatt's and you like IPAs? Yeah, because it's got citrus hops in it. You kind of get that IPA kind of taste from it and off the Dog. bat. <laughs> He's being a pain in the ass. Because they have anywhere to lay, that's why. Yeah, because like right off the bat, you get the hop taste. But it kind of dissipates and goes straight into a lager. It's not an IPA. No. Tips is, tips is for I don't water. understand. Like, you got these big, huge breweries that don't get into the trends. And don't get, you know, make IPAs. Because they, they got all, market share. They don't need to. They got all this money to make these beers. Oh, they make enough money making one beer. We're not the only ones that buy IPAs. No. <laughs> But honestly, this is this is a step up from normal Labatt. Yeah, I probably could drink this in the summertime. Yeah, not. I mean, four point seven with citra hops is kind of a little bit of a letdown, I guess. They could squeeze a little bit out of that, maybe, maybe like five point two, maybe five point six. It gets butter to drink it though. It does, yeah. It's not bad. Bright hot aroma, crisp clean finish. Brews <sighs> with it... citra hops and mosaic. Oh, it's got mosaic hops in it oh. too. This is this is miles better than the um, the Carl's so that we had. Yeah, they're trying to go on the IPA strain, but but keep it a lager. But keep it a lager. Yeah. So 
It's a good effort. Yeah, it's not bad. I can drink this. Make it a double lager, and I'll talk to you. Mm -hmm. Go back. Make it coming back. Make it nine percent. <sighs> make it a nine percent lager. That's what. That's when people. That's. I'm sorry. That's when lagers will sell again. We need the lagers to come back. We need the lagers and the pilsners to come back full force. <laughs> but the last good lager I had was called Mother Lager, the one that I always talk about. Well, we had a. Um, the God damn, what's the name of it? See? Sublime. Uh, Sublime. But um, that was... A little long time ago. Yeah. That was 5.3, I think? 5. Oh, my 7. God. The burps? Yeah. <laughs> the light beer burps. Oh, my God. They're not the best. Yeah, they're not IPA burps. They're good. Creamy. You taste it. You yeah. taste all the good on the way up. Creamy burps. Mm. Give me the cream. Mm. I can't. I can't. Hmm. Too much? I don't know. I, I, it's heavy, but why? It's so much liquid. That's what it is. Yeah, like, look at that. <laughs> why, is it, why is it gelatinous? <laughs> it looks gelatinous, doesn't it? To let you guys know, we just came back, or after, or during this video, the v beer review we did before this was Carlsberg, <clears throat> and it was a quart. Massive we amount had of beer. both one glass. Yeah, we have both. Of them. We slammed it. Yeah, we well, slammed it. We tried until we got to this part and it started stinging the shit out of my throat. But now we have each one of these, so we have a lot of liquid to go is through. Is this a deuce deuce? How much is in here? I can't. I can't read a the lot. side. I can't, the the side is like faded out. Twenty four. About the twenty four ounces. So it's a double. It's two beers in one. Ah, oh, two twelve ounces. And it was like a dollar fifty for one of them. Yeah, that's cheap. I mean, <clears throat> three bucks. Here you go. Um, not what you say. <laughs> no, that's it's, why. It's, that's why we slammed the last one. Yeah, it, it's just citrus hops with a labat aftertaste. It's heavy as shit, though. Yeah. Why is it so heavy? Because it's a lot of. We've drank a lot of liquid in the past half an hour. Yeah, I'm gonna be taking a piss like crazy soon. So. Yeah. Um. And then say is do you think it's better than a normal Labatt? I think it is. Yeah, it's really heavy though mm -hmm. for a lager. I mean, it must be the hops. I, I don't know. Because a normal Labatt, you could just drink and it's so light, it tastes like water. Yeah. But this, it has like that added flavor from the hops. I wonder if they did like the Labatt Blue Lime with Citra and Mosaic hops. I wonder what that would taste like. That might actually taste pretty good. Because I've had the Labatt Blue Lime and it's not, it's not bad. It's just a normal Labatt Blue Lime. It's maybe. not our genre of beers that we love. But yeah. But if you gotta buy beer for everybody at the party. Yeah. Then... I mean Labatt in general isn't that bad of a brewery. No. It's always been a decent beer. Uh, <laughs> it's um, one of those Low grade beers that, if you have to get a low grade beer, you go with that, or you go. What else would you do? Michelob. Heineken, Michelob, yeah, Rolling Rock, ah, eh, Rolling Rock, some Rolling Rock has fell 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 off. Yeah, the last time I was a Rolling Rock was too. trash. Huh? That was a pale ale. That was a pale ale. <laughs> Did you hear that fart from that dog? Yeah, that was loud. <laughs> All right, before we keep this dragging on because we have so much liquid to go through. All right. Three. This little tiny two. Two. One. Five and a half. Five. Don't expect much. Yeah. It gets the job done for what you want, though. Ugh. It's better than a normal bat. It's so damn heavy, though. It is. I, I, I think that the Carlsberg is still heavy on us, too, though, so... Yeah, we have a lot of liquid <laughs> in us. All right, well, subscribe, like... Follow our dumbasses. This is Empty Chamber 556. Follow me on Instagram. It's more artsy. It's just pictures of beer. Have a great night.